we got a package and it's a geodesic chicken coop so that's what we're going to be doing today we're going to put this chicken coop together zip ties and pvc okay so this is a 16 foot wide geodesic dome uh, and it's gonna be, we're gonna put chicken wire or hardware cloth on the outside and we're gonna use it as a chicken tractor for meat birds this year. So, uh, basically this goes together, it's a bunch of PVC pipe and a bunch of zip ties and it goes together and then you've got about 222 square feet of pasture space inside of the coop for the birds. So, basically like a, you know, Plumber meets Legos meets chicken farmer, I guess. I don't know. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna pull all this stuff out. We're gonna see what it looks like. I'm gonna try to find the instructions because I don't know if I'm smart enough to put this together without the instructions. So let's get into it. All right, so I found the manual. Uh, we got a two frequency geodesic dome assembly manual. Uh, this is from ziptiedomes.com. Zip Tie Domes is a United States based company. They are out of Buffalo Valley, Tennessee. Um, I've read good things on the internet and I, I really like this concept. I think that it's, uh, it's kind of a revolutionary design and what it's used for. I mean, we've been using geodesic domes for a long time, but the fact that we're gonna be putting chickens in it, I think it's just gonna be kind of one of those things that people really look twice at and it, it makes them think. Um, and really, essentially, that's kind of our goal here on the farm is to make people think outside of the box to kind of shift that food paradigm that, that they've been used to for so long. So, we're gonna get into it. Okay, so I just read through the manual. Uh, it is possible to put this thing together by myself, uh, but it looks like it's gonna be a lot easier if I have a second set of hands. Uh, so I think I'm going to wait on Jessica to put this together uh, because then that's going to give her the opportunity to learn how this thing goes together and know, you know, how it works and all of that. So that way I'm not the only person uh, that, you know, kind of is familiar with that process. It'll just, I feel like, make it a lot easier uh, because if these things are successful here on the farm, uh, we're definitely going to be purchasing more. So this is kind of a trial run. Uh, and there's potential that, that we, we may be purchasing way more of these or potentially constructing our own in the future. Uh, so with that being said, I'm going to just go back to normal operations here on the farm. I've got some garden beds that I've been working on and uh, a couple other things that I need to get taken care of. Uh, it's starting to warm up quickly and I have a feeling I'm going to get behind the curve, um, unfortunately, but it kind of is what it is. This year is going to be an experimental year anyway, so I'm not really in a rush uh, for anything specifically. So I'm going to just do some stuff around the farm today, like I said, and then I will put the geodesic dome together later whenever I have Jessica's help. Okay, so I'm not actually gonna go step by step and do each step for you guys because if you were to order your own, it comes with very detailed instructions. Uh, so I'm just gonna let you guys watch what we're doing as we're doing it.
<laughs> All right, that'll do it for this video. This thing was pretty easy to put together. It took us like an hour and a half total. We ordered this from ziptiedomes.com. I'll leave a link in the description for sure. Uh, really great product. It was really easy to put together, really high quality materials. So I'm pretty impressed.